Hey guys, welcome to the Hyperlink where we get the latest Star Citizen news as they drop. Star Citizen Alpha 3.18, I think this is the F patch just dropped. It could be the G patch, I'm not sure, but it was just a few hours ago it just dropped. And we're going to talk about some of the new uh, things that they're adding to the patch. Before we get started, I'd like to give a shout out to my channel members and Patreon. I also like to give a shout out to o Omec Ultra for rejoining the membership. Thank you for your continual support. All right. Also, um, we're still doing a giveaway for the Anvil Centurion. So if you want to still participate, you can click the link on the top right corner or you find a link down below in the description. All right. It still says 80% of y'all that continue to watch my content is not subscribed. So do me a favor, hit the like and subscribe button um, as it will help me reach my goal of 20k subscribers by the end of this year. That's the end of this month, guys. So just do me a favor and subscribe. All right. So um, the latest patch in Star Citizen uh, for 3.18 in Evo Cardi. Um, just a few things. Um, essentially, it's the same test and focus as before. If you see my previous video but uh there was a little confusion in regards to bedlock um he's, initially people thought that bedlock was removed from um star citizen until further notice but um it seems like the staff of cig came back and um iterated that they um just because they removed a certain feature doesn't mean that it's permanently removed so people initially thought that bedlock was permanently removed but it was um, specifically to probably um, work through certain bugs so they just removed it temporarily it seems so um, I don't think it's going to be removed I think it's going to be a part of the whole persistence thing so I don't think that's going to be gone for sure up next they also mentioned that the uh, uh, in regards to stowing your character it says uh this new build has a additional work to stow player entities cross shards. If you're unable to unstow the player from the previous one, if you could please wait four to five minutes. If it stays loading for a long time, this should be enough time for it to detect and unstow from the other shard. Okay, so essentially the way it's, it seems like it's going to work is if your character is in a shard and you log off, it's going to unstow your character. It's supposed to unstow your character. And um, and I believe also your items and also your... I'm not sure if it's going to unstow your ship. If it, I think... I'm not even sure how that's going to work. I think your ship... If you don't stow your ship at a station... If you stow your ship at a station... Then it will unstow the ship when you log off. But if you leave your ship out in the open somewhere it will keep the ship at that location until you log back into the same shard okay so that essentially that's how it's designed and um so if you do stow um your ship at a station then it will unstow you and your ship and um it will stow it will put you back in when you log into a different shard it will put you and your ship back in so that seems like that's my current understanding on how this is going to work for 318 but we will see when we actually get our hands on it up next is the repair tool they finally added the repair tool that they mentioned when they initially started talking about 318 and pes um in uh, one of the inside star citizen i think about a month ago okay so it says uh repair tool is replacing the old reset option on the site so that is interesting so one of the repair it says once the repair is complete the following will happen your player avatar will be recreated your spawn point will be reset you will need to recustomize your character inventory items currency mission progress will persist that is amazing that is amazing so um yeah so that 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 means they've kind of isolated your because i think initially if you reset your character um right now you, you i think you lose everything um especially your mission progress i think i think you definitely lose your mission progress right so um so that that's going to be a, a really interesting feature because they also did mention 
um, in a few Inside Star Citizen Go, they said if you need, there's an issue with your character, they can go in and specifically fix that issue and not have to completely wipe your character and recreate it. So um, that's what this Repair 2 is going to be about. So I'm going to be really interested in that. I also got some more 318 leaks. If you haven't seen it already, make sure to, if you want to stay up to date, make sure to check out this video. All right, I'll see you.